Aida Shalawam. Uh, first and foremost, I give her all praise, glory, and honor unto Yahweh Bahashem, Yahweh Shai. Now, I'd like to give her double honors unto our, our apostles and elders at Great Milestone. And uh, much blessing to you, brothers out there, labor with your truth and sincerity. Okay. Uh, uh, just want to go into a quick lesson. Uh, pretty much uh, dealing with the whole situation. Well, uh, things uh, seem a little bit quiet. Okay. Um, scriptures say, uh, scriptures say, um, when they shall say peace and safety, then sudden destruction shall come upon them, man. Okay. So this time, this time that we are, man, where, uh, you know, where, when you, when you, when, you know, when you're looking for prophecies in the news, man, you know, you have to dig a little bit harder because, you know, it seems, uh, it seems, uh, there's not too much that's happening. You know, really, man, uh, the elites, man, they're, they're working at it, man, in the backgrounds, man, okay? So, like, pretty much this time, man, it's, uh, it's a time where, uh, you know, you're supposed to, uh, keep yourself busy in, you know, uh, getting this truth, man, getting this understanding, man, seeking, seeking the Heavenly Father, man, okay? Uh, you know, let me get this one scripture, you know, it wasn't on my mind, but, you know, the fact that I've said that, let me bring it up, man, I bring it up quite a lot, man, okay? Uh, this is Revelation 7 and 1, and it says, uh, And after these things, I saw four angels standing on the four corners of the earth, holding the four winds of the earth, that the winds should not blow on the earth, nor on the sea, nor on the tree. Okay. Uh, the winds, man, that's uh, that destruction, man. Okay. Uh that destroying wind, man, I believe it's in the book of the Isaiah, man, that speaks about destroying wind, man, those, the nuclear destruction, man, okay, and pretty much uh, the end of this deal, man, the end of this man's uh, system, man, and the deliverance of uh, the nation of Israel, okay, so, you know, uh, they still, and it says, and I saw an, another angel ascending from the east, having the seal of the living power, and he cried, out with a loud voice to the four angels to whom it was given to hit the earth and the sea, saying, Had not the earth, never the sea, nor the trees, till we have sealed the servants of the servants of our power in their foreheads, man. So that's the point, okay? Being sealed <laughs> uh being sealed, man, with uh uh with this truth, man, which is uh with this truth, this wisdom which which is the seal uh which is the seal that the Yahweh Shimia Shai put on you man in order for you to be saved man okay um uh, let me get another scripture okay so that's the point man you know it's you know it's no that's as soon as as soon as the elect are sealed man it's game over man okay this prophet is gonna off come real you know, cause people people are getting again complacent, man. Okay. Everybody's people are getting at being at ease and you know, just doing whatever the hell they wanna do, man. And you know, not thinking anything about anything, man, okay? Making plans for the next ten years, mortgages and shit, okay? We're not in the time man where you know you know, where you're supposed to find where you build you be you be trying to create a plan for how you're gonna buy yourself a new house or or whatever man your 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 next plan life that's people that's your next plan for the next 10 years that's things that people in the world do man okay i've gone of course a little bit man but you know just saying scriptures are coming to mind so i'm gonna get them anyway uh so i like you This is uh, Ezekiel 9 and 4, and it says, And Yahweh said unto him, Go through the midst of the city, through the midst of Jerusalem, and set a mark upon the foreheads of the men 
the sign and cry for all the abominations that be done in the midst thereof. Okay. And if you look up that word mark, it means uh, to be exempt from judgment. Okay. And uh, that's the point, man. You know, that's what you're supposed to be getting, man. This mark is this understanding, man, of uh, this truth, man. Okay. You know, you, you're, you're seeking, you're seeking, uh, to, you know, you, you, you're seeking uh, to get better, better at it, to get more understanding, you know, to fulfill, to, uh, you know, to, to finish it, man, okay? Because, you know, the truth, the truth is, the truth is vast, okay? The truth is, uh, is not something you can learn in one sit down, man, okay? If we find out that the nuclear missiles are coming tomorrow, there's no way somebody, uh, the previous night, man, Somebody can sit down with you, man, and try and teach you the, this whole truth, man. Okay, like you know, like during the time uh, when if you if you if you were in school, and uh, and uh, you exam, you most people what they do is they spend uh, they spend their time studying for the for the exam the, the previous night. Okay, you sp you stay up all night studying for this exam, and you know, some people pass, some some people fail, man. But you know, this truth is vast, man. You can't do that with this truth, man. Okay. While things are quiet, and while things, and while things are, and while things uh seem uh while the opportunity is still there, man, you're supposed to be getting this understanding, man. Okay. Uh. This is a James uh one, and twenty one. It says, uh, wherefore lay apart, uh, all filthiness and superfluity of naughtiness, and receive with meekness. The engrafted word which is able to save your soul. Okay. And that's what you're supposed to be. You, you lay apart everything else, man. That's what you're supposed to be occupied with, man. Okay. You know, we're in the flesh. So every single time, man, you know, we are constantly being, being hindered, man, to try and knock us, uh, to try and knock certain so is hindering, hindering us all the time to try and knock, knock us off that path, man. But you know, it, you know, scripture say he who he he who overcometh man. And part of overcoming man is overcoming this flesh man, overcoming yourself man, okay. And constantly fighting man, you know, constantly fighting, you know, to get this understanding and to stay in this truth man, okay, and to to stay on that narrow narrow path man, which you know Yahweh Bashim Asha set up man, okay. <laughs> Cause it's not it's not an it's not an easy ride, man. Okay. This is our Ecclesiastics uh twelve and one, and it says, "Remember now thy Creator in the days of thy youth." Okay. From the time you're cause from the time you're a young man, you know it's because you know it's always better to get this knowledge while you're a young man and you build yourself to it, man. That you know. Um, uh, I believe the scriptures say uh. I'm not sure if I word it properly, but it speaks about how gain the knowledge while you're young. So when you're older, you're wise, man. Okay. But remember now the creator in the days of thy youth, while the evil while the evil days come not. Okay. So while you still have the time, while you still have the time to do so, you know, remember Yahweh Bashim Yashai, man. You know, while his men are still here teaching, okay. While well, you still have a way in order to get breakdowns and understandings for certain things, man. Okay, uh, not the years, not the years draw nigh when thou shalt say, "I have no pleasure in them." Uh, verse two. While well, the sun or the light or the moon or the stars be not darkened, nor the clouds return after the rain. Okay, in the day when the keepers of the of the house shall tremble, man. The keepers of the house is are uh, the rulers of this uh of this uh world man okay and the strong men shall bow themselves and the grind the grinder shall cease when you start to see loss of jobs okay because there are few and those that look out the window those that look out of the window be darkened and the doors shall be shut in the streets okay all kind of business is going out when the sound when the sound of the grounding is low okay and he shall rise up at the voice of the bird and all the daughters of music shall be brought low, man. And you see that man with this music being so rubbish, man. Okay. 
but the point is yeah okay you know don't don't wait man till you realize man or you you know you realize your the whatever whatever job was keeping you so busy man at, you know from getting this understanding that you know that made you put this this truth to the side you find out now that whatever you know you find out the the, it's, the business itself has gone under you know then you realize now then you then you realize that we are at that time now man okay at that end okay uh so it's better now man wow wow you still can man because right now is yeah if you know if any single kind of breakdown you need man you can just go on youtube man, and you get it man there's a the apostles or the elders or the one of the brothers has, has put it out there man has broke it down for you man the answer is there genesis one and one the answer is there man the books of revelation the answer is there man okay wow is still here okay because soon enough man you're gonna find it's all gone you will not be have you will not have access to it man okay this is isaiah 55 and 6 and it says seek ye, seek seek ye, seek ye yahweh while he may be found go upon him while he is near man okay how is he near because his men are there man the the prophets the videos the men are in the highways and the byways okay every saturday and they are there, man, to give an answer, man. Okay? To give an answer, to break down the scriptures. You know, whatever, you know, whatever it may be, man. Okay? Uh, verse 7. Let the wicked forsake his way, and the unrighteous man his thoughts, man. Okay? And let him return unto your house, and he will, he will have mercy upon him, and to our power, for he will abundantly, abundantly pardon, man. Okay? And that's this is why you still have the opportunity, okay? Because this year, man, this year, man, it could, it could, it could, it could all be gone, man, okay? Uh, this is a Proverbs eight and seventeen. I love them that love me, and those that seek me early shall find me, okay? Brothers, you know, okay? There's brother, you know, there's brothers that have got this understanding, and to the point that even they have become teachers themselves. And they're teaching others, man. Okay, and that's what you, you know. That's what you'll be looking for, man. To become a, to to build yourself up to a level where you become a teacher, man. You you can't keep watching the videos forever. Okay, after a certain time, you know, after a certain time, you're gonna have to get involved, man. One one way or another, man. You can't be the guy. You can't decide that. Oh, you know what is yeah. You can't you can't put the truth in a napkin, man. One of the brothers, man, from uh, GMS Born Again, man. I think he put up a really good video, man, about you know napkin niggas, man. Okay. Uh this is a uh, uh, Baroque four and twenty eight, and it says, "For as it, for as it was, for as it, for as it was, your mind to go astray from the Most High, so being returned, have you been returned? You've been told that you are an Israelite." You are, you are an Israelite, okay? And now, you know, you know these scriptures may pertain to you, okay? Uh, for as it was in your mind to go astray from the most time and, you know, we went to worship other gods to the point that Heavenly Father, man, kicked us out of uh, the, the land of Israel, man, okay? So being returned, seek him ten times more, man, okay? Do everything that you can within your power, man, to be on the good side of Yahweh, Hashim, Yahshai, Okay? Uh, this is at uh, Amos 8 and 11, and it says, Behold, the days come, saith Yahweh power, that I will send a famine in the land, not a famine of bread, not of thirst, of water, but of hearing the words of Yahweh Bashim Yahshai. Okay? So, that, and that's, that's a prophecy right there, man. So, eventually, man, eventually, it's gonna be, it's gonna be gone, man. Okay? You're gonna find yourself you're gonna find yourself in a situation you're gonna find yourself in a situation whereby so like, you're gonna find yourself in a situation whereby you've not at you've not obtained this uh this truth man this understanding and uh you're gonna be looking for it and you will not be able to man okay uh, let me get another scripture
because this is a this is a proverbs 1 and 23 and it says uh ten you at my reproof behold i will pour out my spirit unto you i will make known my words unto you because i have called and you refused okay i have stretched up my hand and no man regarded okay but you have set at not all my counsel and would none of my reproof man okay you were you weren't taking heed man you know whether I, you know you you put it to the side you thought you know uh you know you uh you know it's always gonna be there you know you had better things to do okay <laughs> you had better things to do or whatever whatever reason it is man that you thought uh getting this truth you know uh, was not all that important man okay verse 26 i will also laugh at your calamity i will mock you when your fear cometh okay when your fear come cometh as desolation and your destruction cometh as a whirlwind when distress and anguish come upon you okay then shall they call upon me but i will not answer now you're looking for the truth now you're looking for the prophets okay now you're looking for somebody to break down the scriptures for you okay now you're looking for the for the trying to find the internet connection trying to still trying to figure out if you know if there'll be any videos online and after that they'll probably, they would have probably shut down the internet or maybe there would have been no electricity whatsoever man no online man none of these gadgets would have been working man okay because desolation is coming man okay the heavenly father is coming to put an end to you know, all these shenanigans man okay then shall they call upon me but i will not answer they shall seek me early and they sh but they shall not find me okay for that they hated the knowledge and did not choose the fear of yahweh what's 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 the beginning of wisdom and the fear of yahweh okay they would none of my counsel they despised all my reproof how'd you get the reproof for the for the prophets man the men that teach your teachers the prophets, the men in the highways and the byways, okay? Therefore shall they eat the of the fruit of their own way and be filled with their own devices, which is destruction, man, okay? For the turning away of the simple shall slay them, and the prosperity of fools shall destroy them. But, but whoso hearkeneth unto me shall dwell safely and shall be quiet from the fear of evil. Okay, how do you hearken to the to Yahweh Shimia Shaman? Through his men, the men that because the the the, hey, the men of the men the men that are teaching this word men have given up their lives, man. I know I know I know brothers right now is that they the they, they everything to the side, man. They the scripture said deny yourself. I know brothers that hey man. You know, I've I have a little something, I've got a job, you know, I've got a little place that I live in, okay. And when I'm next to these brothers, man, up, you know, there's brothers that you think you think you're going for shit, and you think you've you've denied this, you know, denied denied this word. There's brothers that have put everything to the side, man, and they give they give their their whole, their their you know their everything, man, to Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai, okay. And anyway. Anyway, verse 33 again. But whoso hearkeneth unto me shall dwell safely and shall be quiet from the fear of evil, men. This is the time to get it, man. Okay? It, it, could be, it could be tomorrow, could be next week, could be next month, it could be, you know, end of summer. Okay? This shit could pop off anytime, man. It just takes one thing to happen, one, thing, one major thing to happen, man, to shake down everything else, man. Okay? When uh, the credit crunch happened, man, I believe in 2008, you know, for the reason why there were so many queues also in, in the banks, it's because nobody expected it, man. It just so happened, and people, everybody started rushing to, to, to go get their money out, man, because nobody saw it coming. And the, the next one's going to be the same thing, okay? Uh, this is a Matthew 25 and 1 says then shall the kingdom of heaven be likened unto ten virgins which took their lamps and went forth to meet the bridegroom and the five of them were wise and the five were foolish okay they that were foolish took took their lamps and took no oil with them okay the oil represents uh, this knowledge and understanding 
okay but the wives took oil in their vessels with with their lamps okay they studied they got this understanding okay it was you know you know they got grounded okay uh, verse 5 while the bridegroom tarried they all slumbered and slept what does tarried mean mean you know let's look what tarried mean because that's the scripture say uh though it tarry wait for it man for the vision is for an appointed time though it tarry uh, to tarry is to linger to delay to tarry man okay so it's you know like when the north korea thing happened we think okay something something major is gonna kick off and then all of a sudden it's gone quiet a little bit so now you know you know yaoba shima shai has a little bit man you know you know so don't fall asleep man you know maybe you know they use that opportunity man to you know to you know to 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 build on your talents uh to build on your talent to uh uh, to lay your treasures in heaven, man. Okay, to build on yourself, man. To get yourself correct with your how about you, shy, man. You know, as I say that, man. I'm even, you know, I'm speaking even to myself, man. You know, constantly, to, constantly, uh, constantly, uh, examine yourself, man. Okay. You know, you know, you want when your how about you, shy comes back, man. He finds you without spot, man. Okay. Because you know, every but every brother knows themselves, man. You know which category best fits you, man okay uh verse five again while the bridegroom tarried they all slumbered and slept okay verse six and at midnight there was a cry made behold the bridegroom come the bride bridegroom cometh go ye out to meet him okay then all these virgins arose and trimmed their lamps and the foolish said unto the wise give us give us of your oil for our lamps are gone out okay why why are their lamps gone out because they because they slumbered and slept okay they were foolish virgins okay verse 9 but the wise answered saying not so lest there be not enough for us and you but go ye rather to this go ye rather to them that sell and buy for yourselves okay at verse 10 but while they were by while they went to buy the bride the bride the bridegroom came and they that were ready went in with him to the marriage and the door was shut man that's it man okay when you know when 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 things are when things start happening when shit starts popping it will be game over if you didn't get it if you don't get if you don't if you're not getting it now you will not get it then okay if you're not getting it now you will not get it then okay uh, verse 11 afterward came also the the other virgin saying lord lord open to us but he answered and said verily i say unto you i know you not verse 13 watch therefore for ye know for ye know neither the day nor the hour wherein the son of man cometh which is yahweh shai okay um anyway pretty much i think i've made my point You know before the evil days come man get this truth man get yourself involved one way or another man okay you know if, if you know if you know getting getting yourself involved within a cup man holding the camera or assignment that's part of doing the work man okay get yourself involved one way or another man okay you know you know you you where you wanna be is to be sure man to be, not to be in a situation whereby you're still unsure man you know you understand you know you're you're you know you're still at home wondering oh shit you know you 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 never get yourself involved in anything and you know them demons are gonna plague your mind man and use that against you man okay anyway with that man i'd like to thank you how about shimmy and uh i hope this video was uh edifying and uh shalawam